astronaut goes outside the space station, they are covered head to toe in the strongest insulation possible because they're dealing with extreme cold temperatures. Well, our next guests have created their unique outerwear jackets, which are made using the same material as NASA spacesuits, but as you can see, they aren't nearly as bulky or heavy as spacesuits. Oros Apparel was created by Rithvik Venna and Michael Marksbury and in their dorm room, and uh, they're talking about the future of outdoor wear. Thanks for being here, guys. Yeah, yeah thanks, thanks for having for us. us. Okay, so Michael, talk to me about how exactly does this technology work? Yeah, great question. What we do is we take the aerogel insulation used by NASA to insulate the spacesuits and put it into outerwear so you can actually wear gear that's thinner, lighter, and warmer. Uh, I'm guessing that this technology has been around for a while. Why is it only now being put into clothes that I can buy? Yeah, this technology has been around for a while, and NASA's been using it for almost 40 plus years. But we were the, one of the first companies that actually went out and wanted to purpose build an aerogel that's used and, and can revolutionize the apparel industry. There are a lot of companies out there with great coats, and they say, buy me, I'm going to keep you warm. Uh, how, how warm can I stay in this coat? How cold can we get? So at Oros, we really do believe in uh, torture tests. We've done two things. We've done the standard, what everybody does, take it to a, take it to a mountain. The mountain we chose was Everest. Sure. Gave it to seven guys. <laughs> if you're going to go big, go big. Yeah, might as well. Uh, gave it to seven guys. They went up, summited it. Awesome, great reviews. Uh, but we wanted to take it a step further. I don't know if you ever heard of liquid nitrogen. Oh, I have, yeah. I think it's hissing behind me here. <laughs> yeah. Extremely, extremely cold material. So one of the things that we do is we put one of our guys in our jacket, Michael, our CEO, and uh, we spray him with liquid nitrogen. So you're, you're going to put your money where your mouth is? Absolutely. Every time. Really? Okay, so you do that. I'm going to stand over here awesome. very far away. Gotcha. So, so how cold does this get? It's about uh, negative 321 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, so yeah, so this is the real deal. Yeah, oh yeah, two and a half times colder than any temperature ever recorded if, on Earth. If this were to touch your skin, the big problems. Bad news about, bears. Yeah. Okay. Some okay. heavy frostbite. Okay. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, okay. Whoa. Oh God. So Michael, what are you feeling right now? I feel pretty warm right now. Re like you're not feeling a cold, a cold jet of air on your back? Nothing. Come on. Nothing. What? At, like, now your legs aren't insulated, so are you feeling some cold down there? Starting to feel a little chilly on my legs, but my back's totally your fine. Your back is totally fine? Totally You're, fine. Are you <laughs> Okay, now, how long could you do this for before it would, I don't know, before you start feeling the effects? Because you're... You're laying it on thick. <laughs> you could do it on the back for a while, but uh, after a little bit, the legs will start to feel a little chilly. So, you, so your legs would start feeling cold long before you'd even feel anything on your back. Absolutely. That's amazing. Let me look at the yeah, back again. You want to touch it? You can touch yeah, it. Is it. Go for it. Can yeah. I touch it? It's totally safe. Oh, it's, it's, it's like, oh, it's frozen. Yeah. It's frozen. Can I, can I you touch it? Yeah, I want to feel the inside. Yeah. Feel the temperature difference? Yep, yeah, big time. Big time. Absolutely. Okay, so it keeps, keeps heat, it keeps cold out, keeps heat in, but is there a danger of overheating? No, not at all, and that's the big difference. There's a lot of insulations today, like Goose Down, aren't very breathable, so you can't do a lot of performance outdoor activities in them. Aerogel Solar Core, totally different. Yeah. Uh, they have roughly 40 CFM, which is immense breathability when you get into the insulation space. This is, uh, this is amazing. I mean, I, it's a test like this, it really, let me look at your back again. That's, Amazing. It's still, it's still hard there. That's incredible. Guys, congratulations. I think, I think you're on to something here. Uh, <laughs> thanks so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for all having, the best. Thanks for having Seriously, us. Seriously, all the best. Thanks so much. And we'll be